So here we are at the last segment of Service Management Made Simple. Along the way, we've talked a lot about many aspects of what makes a quality service operation functional. And many of these aspects may be changes that, that you're going to want to make, uh, even if it's just one change that you're going to want to make. It will make a huge difference in your, in your organization. I would offer this advice to you. Uh, if, if you found anything at all that, that you like within either the pages of the book or the DVD, go ahead and implement them. Don't be afraid to experiment. Don't implement them all at once. Implement them slowly. Take one idea at a time. Take one little idea. Or modify something you're already doing based on an idea that came to mind. Now, all of these best practices that we've talked about, they're just that. They were somebody's idea at some point. They put them in play, they implemented them, they modified them, they massaged them, they got them to the point where they are today. Don't be afraid to experiment with your own. Now, I will suggest to you though that any change is difficult. When you implement something new in any organization, no matter what size it is, you're going to have some challenges. Somebody in your organization will be a naysayer and they'll say, what are we doing this for? We shouldn't be doing this. It doesn't make sense. The old way works just fine. I don't get it. And you've got a certain level of productivity where you're at and you want it to go up. So you implement a change where you're at today. And what happens when you implement change? Productivity, efficiency, sometimes morale, drop. And they'll drop. And you'll start to get nervous. And somebody in the organization is going to say, I told you so, let's just go back to the old way. Please don't get frustrated because eventually that performance is going to bottom out. That drop will bottom out, I promise you that. And then you'll start to see encouraging results. And as it starts to come up on the other side, you'll reach the same productivity, the same efficiency that you were at before. And then that change will start to see you exceed the previous productivity. Many people refer to it as the J-curve of change. And I just want you to be prepared for that drop in productivity, the drop in efficiency, maybe the drop in customer satisfaction, or the drop in profitability. It's okay. Give the implementation time to work. These ideas are all proven. You're not the only one trying it. Many other organizations have done it, and they've done it successfully. Or it wouldn't have been brought to this DVD. So implement your change. Bear with, the, bear with the, the negative aspects of it because you will see improvement and you will excel and you will get to where you want to go. I hope you've enjoyed the DVD. Feel free to contact us at intelligentmechanic.com anytime you want. We're always loving to hear from our, our clients. Keep up the good work and never stop learning.